Hitchhiking and walking the streets of Afghanistan. Afghanistan Radustarin. Afghanistan, Afghanistan has a very interesting culture. I found out when I walked all the markets in Kabul and I really wanted to do that in the north too. It's time to check out the bazaar here in Masa Sharif in the north of Afghanistan. Let's go. So many people and so much energy in these vibrant streets where you can find everything you need. So we're walking around the bazaar here. There's nothing like walking around these streets and observe the people. The fruits and vegetables are on another level in Afghanistan. In fact, Afghanistan exports fruits and vegetables to 41 countries. It's a special feeling seeing all of this as the only tourist in the streets. There are not many places where this can happen in the world. Usually you see another tourist passing by, but this is not really the case here. That makes it just even more special. And there are so many unique looks here. They have all kind of vegetables, all kind of fruits, all kind of drinks. Everything you need is here in the market in Masa Sharif. And there's always some uh, boys following. <laughs> I made so many good friends in these streets, but I also sometimes had to be creative with the way to avoid being stuck in the big crowds, as you can see. I think we have to go a new way here, to avoid the crowds. Chaos. The only thing here is you need to be a little careful about the traffic, like the cars are passing you from everywhere and the motorbikes. Uh, so you need to have a look on the roads. That's important. Afghanistan has been ethnically diverse for millennia and it's obvious to see here in the food market. Okay, that was the food market. Masa Sharif is awesome. On to the next destination. And uh, now we are at a clothing market. A lot of clothes. Yeah, it's a really good atmosphere. The blue-colored burqa, also referred to as the shuttlecock, is native to Afghanistan and it completely covers the body as a single piece of cloth. But not all women wear it, though you'll mostly see men walking freely in the streets while the women usually are covered. Purda, as it's called, is part of the culture and the tradition for some. Hello. The blue burqa especially has become associated with older women in Pashtun community and even women belonging to the lower socio-economic strata. So many people. This is different from other countries, but I still like walking around the streets in Afghanistan and experiencing a different culture. Here you really have the chance to do that. A magical country and so diverse. I also went to some really trendy indoor shops where people enjoy themselves. So cool. Now we are indoor. So also a lot of stuff inside. How is life in Masaj today? No, I like it. It's okay? Have you had any bad experiences in the Masaj? Any bad things? No, no. No problem. Uh, no, good? No, I'm for me. Masaj is yeah. good. I'm from Denmark. Denmark, Denmark. Nice to meet you. Nice, nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I travel for people and don't let a big Afghan bear scare you. It doesn't have to be dangerous, right? So many curious and friendly faces here and a big Afghanistan Sindabad. I know the new generations of Afghanistan will make their country proud. Put an end to the media's negativity. That's what I've seen with my own eyes and I just want to let all of you good Afghan people know to never give up. Because the good always beats the evil. It's all about persistence and when you are being the best version of yourself, that's when you can change things. People are just people, they shouldn't make you nervous. The world is everlasting, it's coming and it's going. Afghanistan has a place in my heart. Afghanistan Sera Minalalam. Manana, thank you. I studied at Valve University. You studied in university? Yes, I was student at Valve University. What is your dream? I want to become an expert teacher. At... I want to learn English perfectly. Yeah, you speak good English. Now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I want to continue it and improve. What Not... do you do here? I'm just a tourist here. Yeah. Tourist? Traveling around Afghanistan for two weeks. Wow, that is great. Have you been to Afghanistan? Please comment below. Remember to subscribe to Gus on the Go.